What's up guys? Welcome back to Wimpy Fitness and today I'm going to show you guys a quick and very effective chest routine. It's only three exercises and six sets each uh, exercise. But the thing is, I do 30 seconds rest in between. So with this workout, you can either do definitely of course by yourself or you can go ahead and do it with a partner. But you can only do it with one partner. Uh, Julian's getting started. This isn't a... <laughs> This isn't included in the 18 sets, uh, but I do like to get this warm up in um, because I don't want to go and start my my workout for the day and have to get warmed up. This right here, which you guys will see, I'll go ahead and have Julian film me, but um, I like to use it as a warm up. That way, when I go into the actual exercises, I'm not warming up anymore. They're all working sets. But uh, without further ado, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, shut up talking and uh, the workout will be in the description box. And uh, yeah, so see you soon. So with these right here, uh, we're at our what, fifth set? So we're at our fifth set, and usually typically people would do when they start getting uh, into more sets, they start getting tired and their form will start turning to trash. And with this uh, routine, you don't want to keep on just pressing and going like this. You want to continuously, when you come up, squeeze, and come down the whole six sets. That's how you really get that nice pump and burn in your chest. So you'll notice, check this set out. I'm not gonna go like this, because of course you're gonna get tired. You gotta really push. You know what I'm saying? To get that squeeze every time you come up. So I'm shooting for 12. Hey. So uh, Julian just went down in weight. He took the 25s off and went ahead and put 10s on. Uh, that's one thing that's going to happen through this routine is sometimes you're going to have to drop the weight a little bit and focus more on the form. This routine is more about the form than how much weight you're moving. Got to squeeze at the top, man. No pushing and keep on uh, crappy form. Squeeze at the top. Control it when it comes down. That's it, I'm tired. seen us do the seated flies and then the last exercise was to do the hammer strength decline but somebody was using that machine so instead of waiting around for that machine uh, we decided that we were going to do extra credit after we were doing our last uh, workout but since it was taken we're going to go ahead and just jump right into our extra credit before we even get to our last set so this right here isn't actually part of the routine I usually do for that quick effective chest routine 
Uh, but hey, you know what I'm saying? It's Friday. We try and get these games, and sometimes you gotta mix it up. So uh, without further ado, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys what we're doing with this right here. How many was that? Eleven. Nice. Get one more. Get one more. Push it. Oh yeah, too easy. Too easy. Yes, sir. See? There you go. All right, guys, that's the end of the workout. Um, it didn't go as planned uh, to a certain extent just because uh, certain machines were taken. And the purpose of this workout is to like go, 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 30 seconds rest in between. But we still got work in. As you saw, we kind of did the extra credit before we did the last set. But uh, the three exercises were supposed to be the incline hammer strength, the seated flies, and then the decline hammer and six sets a piece like i said 30 seconds in between definitely gonna get that muscle endurance working and you're gonna get an epic pump so if you guys get a chance go ahead and try that routine out let me know what you think comment below if you tried it out and uh always remember to take it one day at a time guys peace